Hey kids, welcome back again. Children, today it's time to start the part E of lesson 11, our solar system. So let's get started. First question is, how is the sun useful to us? Ki sun hamare liye kaise useful hai? Answer is, sun is useful to us in following ways. Number one, it gives energy in the form of heat and light. Number two, it is essential for growth and maintenance of all forms of life on earth. Number three, we all depend on sun indirectly for our food. Number four, solar cells are used in various devices. Next question is, name the terrestrial planets. Why are they so called? Answer to the question is Mercury, Venus, Earth and Mars are the names of terrestrial planets. They are so called because these planets have structures similar to Earth. These are made up of rocks and metals. Next question is state the conditions necessary for existence of life on a planet. Answer to the question is, conditions necessary for existence of life on a planet are Number 1. Presence of atmosphere Number 2. Presence of liquid water on the surface Number 3. Right size and right distance from the sun Next is, why do we observe phases of moon? Answer is we observe phases of moon because of the changes in the relative position of the earth and the moon with respect to the sun. These phases include completely dark phase, amavas or new moon, a complete bright phase, purnima or full moon day. Last question is state two uses to which Artificial satellites are being put. Answer is two uses to which artificial satellites are being put are number one, they are used in communication for transmitting radio, telephone, and television signals. Number two, they are used in weather forecasting. So, children, this was all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.